So I recently unboxed the uh, AMD Phenom 2 X6 1090T Black Edition, and now I'm going to be doing its little brother, the X6 1055T. This is not a Black Edition processor, but it's not a, you know, purple, not as strong edition processor either. This is still a 6-core processor. It's clocked a little bit slower than the 1090T at 2.8 gigahertz and up to 3.3 gigahertz in turbo core mode. So that means that when you're running anywhere from one to three software threads, it's going to clock three CPUs with, the, okay, three cores up to 3.3 gigahertz, and then it'll take the other three and clock them down in order to stay within the thermal specifications that AMD set out for this processor. Okay, so like they're saying here, it's a true six core design with nine megs of total cache. It uses socket AM3, which means that it is a drop-in replacement. This is one of the most impressive things about this processor into existing AM3 motherboards. So it has support for both DDR2 and DDR3, and and there are supposedly over 100 boards at launch that with just a BIOS update, they will support the brand new six core processors. AMD's really done a terrific job with their engineering team, making sure that their new processors will work in their old boards. So the 1055T includes the same heatsink by default as the 1090. You can see it uses a copper slab at the bottom. It's got heat pipe soldered. If you want more details on the heatsink, I guess you could watch the other video. It's got fins here and it has a 60 millimeter fan. That's pretty much all there is to really say about it. Next, we have AMD's documentation. Oh, and we have a Phenom 2 case badge. Very nice. I like it. Okay, then we have AMD's certificate of authenticity as well as their warranty terms. And we have Insta oh, how to recognize AMD sockets. That's pretty useful. So they show you everything from socket 754 up to socket F1207. All right, if we unfold this, you'll see that we have an installation guide for how to install the CPU and the uh, heatsink. So here's the one for AM2, AM2 Plus, and AM3. Eight steps, pretty straightforward. If you've ever installed a CPU before, you shouldn't have too much trouble with it. And now let's have a look at the CPU itself. I apologize for going through a little bit quickly on this one, but the cameraman has uh, an important social event that he has to attend, so I don't wanna, I don't wanna keep him for too much longer here. So here is the Phenom 2 X6 955T. I will, did I say 955? I meant 1055T. I will actually be doing um, an overclocking guide featuring this exact processor where I take the sample that I received and turn it all the way up to four Four gigahertz six threads so uh, stay tuned for that here is your am3 socket with i believe ooh, it's 941 pins as i recall and thank you for checking out my unboxing of the amd phenom 2 x6 six core processor this is the 1055t